when it comes to an introvert, they value their peace of mind. There is a lot of people that walk their own paths, that do their own thing. They would rather just be at peace with themselves. And they rather cultivate their own peace. And they'll be perfectly fine just the way they are. They don't need to be involved all the time. They don't need to be up around everybody every five, ten minutes. Introverts can just lay back, chill, reflect, just be at a calm state and enjoy their own company. But I realize a lot of people are not capable of doing that. They're not capable of being comfortable in their own company. A lot of people don't know how to be alone. One thing I learned about being alone is that you can choose to be in a state of peace whenever you want. You see, when you're around a whole bunch of humans, you're around all this energy. You're in a big group, the in crowd. It's going to be very hard for you to be at peace. Because the people in your life, there's people in your life that do not bring you peace of mind. And that's a and that's a problem. It's a problem for introverts. Now, if you're friends with people that are extroverts, that are socialites, that like to have a whole bunch of people around them all the time, they can never be alone. They can't go anywhere by themselves. They are not going to bring you peace because they are not in a state of peace. They don't know how to be in a state of peace because they like to surround themselves with the 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 loudness they like to surround themselves around the noise they like to surround themselves with all these different personalities and they like to blend in their own personality with a whole bunch of other personalities now how is that going to create peace of mind in any individual You're never going to get peace when you hang out with people that are just naturally loud, obnoxious. They talk too damn much. They're very noisy, disruptive. They can't ever be in a in a very zen like state. They can never learn how to just. Be calm cool and collected. They have to always be involved with everybody else. Because if they're not involved with everybody else, they feel like they're missing out. I do believe that introverts have a special gift. And that special gift is to cultivate a state of peace at any time when they're alone. And they're able to live in that present moment. They're able to be fine with their own company. They're able to not feel left out. They're able to 
embrace the struggles of being alone. Having that alone time is very beneficial. You need that alone time. It's, an, it's nearly impossible to get any alone time with folks. Well, any alone time by yourself, I meant to say. When you're surrounded by everybody, when you have all these friends, you have all these associates, all these acquaintances, it's hard enough for you to be in a state of peace. You can't get that state of peace because not everybody's going to bring you peace. Because not everybody that you hang around is built like that. Some people are entertained by drama and gossip. You're, you're hanging out with personalities that do not know how to walk by themselves. They only feel motivated to do anything in life when they're doing it with somebody else. And, the, and to me, that person will never be in a state of peace in their own life. They, they never will. They will never be at peace because they're always trying to be involved with everybody else. They're trying to play catch up with the world. They're trying to keep up with the Jones and they're trying to do what they got to do to fit in with the in crowd. And that comes with a lot of stress and a lot of headache. Trust me, it does. There's a lot of stress that comes with trying to fit in with the and with the in crowd. Trying to be like everybody else. Trying to get people to like you. But here's the thing. You trying to be cool, you trying to win brownie points all the damn time. You're never going to be in a state of peace. You'll never be at peace with yourself. That's one of the greatest gifts you can ever have as an introvert. Is just be at peace with yourself. Because there is no distractions. There's nobody calling your phone. There's nobody trying to text you. There's nobody trying to get you involved with, with certain things. There's not people bothering you. You have certain people in your life that are, you just know them. They're not really your friend, but you just kind of know them. And... They just happen to be there, but they bring nothing to your life. They add no value to your life. They're just floating around. And be careful of those people because they'll just talk to you about anything. Some people are just all about drama and gossip and they'll, and they'll spread drama to you to see what your reaction will be. And some people are willing to entertain this BS drama. But see, you don't care about that. You're not gonna entertain that because what's going on with other people ain't got nothing to do with you because you stayed out the way you have decided to take control of your state of peace, to be in a peace of mind. You prioritize that over trying to entertain drama. 
entertaining gossip. People who entertain gossip and drama all day, they will never be at peace at all. They don't know what peace is like. Peace of quiet. Peace of mind. They will never know what it's like. Because their entire world revolves around drama, revolves around gossip. They can't go the entire day without reading somebody's business online or digging up somebody's past. They can't go about the entire day without trying to tell somebody else somebody else's business that they heard about from somebody else. And now they're trying to spread the rumors, spread the news to everybody that they know, because that's their entertainment to spread news and spread gossip. They ain't got nothing better to do. Nothing. And, you know, being an extrovert, this comes with being an extrovert. Not saying all extroverts are like this, but for the majority, they are like this. They'll be the ones to spread gossip and drama. They'll hear something from somebody down the street and they'll go back and tell you or somebody else just to spread it. Or they'll be talking to you about somebody else. Could be spreading lies, rumors, whatever. And they're entertained by it. That's their vice. Drama. Drama, gossiping, that's their vice. That's their medication. That is their high. And you got to stay away from those people because they don't know anything about peace of mind. They don't. Extroverts, they don't know nothing about peace of mind. They stay be trying to get involved with everybody else. Want to know what's going on with this person, that person. But they don't never, ever take the time to care about their own life. They don't take the time to work on themselves. And they will never know what it's like to be at peace with themselves. Introverts, I'm talking to you guys. You guys got to do better. Prioritizing your peace. Because once you cultivate your inner peace, nothing outside of that can infiltrate it. And you can't let anything infiltrate your inner peace. Because once you cultivate it, nobody can break it. Nobody can, can ruin it. But it's very important for you when you come out of certain friendships and relationships and you do take the time for yourself to be alone, really focus on cultivating inner peace and just being in the present moment. So that being said, make sure you guys like the video for the algorithm. The, the likes are free. Likes are free. No reason why you should not be liking the video. Subscribe if you are new. This is Mr. Solo Dolo. And I'm just now dropping another introvert topic discussion. Another piece of content. With that being said, I'm out. Peace.